My name is Nevin Adams, and I'm a proud recipient of the 2023 Zabralter Medical Award. <laughs> First, I just want to thank you all for being here and showing support for both Dr. Loda and Zabralter Medical. Um, this is truly where change starts, so I want to thank you all for being here. In the U.S., just 5% of physicians and 3% of physician assistants are black, compared to the 14% of the population that we represent. Why is this? This disparity represents the financial and systemic barriers that many African Americans face while pursuing medicine. As a black man myself pursuing medicine, these are barriers I've run into countless times. Sometimes they're obvious, like struggling to pay for an exam or an application fee. And other times they're silent and they come with being underestimated or overlooked in ways that can subtly chip away at your confidence. Scholarships like these build that confidence back up and give students like me reassurance that we are seen, supported, and believed in. That there are people behind us in a journey that can sometimes feel isolating. This award contributed to a truly life-changing experience for me in a study abroad to Cape Town, South Africa. <laughs> Here, I was able to immerse myself in an entirely new culture and continue to expand my worldview. I tried new foods, got to know their history, and most importantly, I was able to meet people with perspectives and experiences different from my own. I spent much of my time abroad volunteering at a free healthcare clinic in an underserved area. And when I first arrived at the clinic, I thought I'd be putting on a few band-aids and maybe taking blood pressures a couple times. But by the end, I was doing things I would have never imagined. I learned how to put on and remove casts, suturing, IV insertion, and I even helped save a patient's life. I can now say confidently that when they told me it would be a hands-on experience, <laughs> that wasn't an exaggeration. <laughs> Beyond all of the excitement, though, I saw the tough realities of a healthcare system that simply didn't have enough resources. Even though I was halfway across the world, I saw similar disparities that we see here in the U.S. Seeing those parallels reminded me that while the setting may the challenges remain the same. This experience solidified my goal of serving the underserved and becoming a culturally competent provider who breaks down barriers of those who come after me. Since that experience, I've co-founded a shelter medicine clinic providing free healthcare to the homeless, done research, immersive research in the social determinants of health in interventional radiology, and I'm currently working as one of five gap year interns at Northwestern Medicine before I begin PA school. Thank you all for believing in me. As I said, this is where the change starts and it truly makes a difference to support students like me. Let's continue to invest in each other, our communities, and create an equitable future for all. Thank you.